This is an ABC 10 News update. County leaders celebrated California's reopening with the community on Tuesday. I'm Steve Atkinson in the ABC 10 News studio. About 100 people attended Back Together San Diego almost without a mask in sight. Guests were able to enjoy music and free breakfast that morning. A ribbon cutting ceremony was also held to signify the reopening of the county's economy. Supervisor Nora Vargas also highlighted the development of the vaccine that made the reopening possible. The county also held its final COVID-19 briefing Good on afternoon. Tuesday. It began by thanking frontline workers, local nonprofits and community members. County supervisors also exceeded their goal of first dose COVID-19 vaccinations by California's reopening. County officials say the community can feel a sense of relief following the reopening as we've made it through a historically challenging time. And San Diego's theme parks can welcome back guests at full capacity now that California has reopened. All guests, including those from out of state, they can take a trip to SeaWorld. However, if people are not fully vaccinated or they don't have a negative COVID test to show, they will need to continue wearing masks. Reservations are no longer required to visit the San Diego Zoo and Safari Park. Fully vaccinated guests will not need to wear a mask, but those two and older and unvaccinated will have to wear a mask inside.